لاغت مطاط نورمالي نورمالي You just don't have the same damage output because the counter spell mm -hmm. and the magic resistance and things. It's hard for them to pressure the AM when the, he gets level three because I assume he gets a point in counter spell. And then at that point, they can't really throw the Venge Sun onto him anymore because he just sends it straight back again. They Where's have the to try and make missile any Icarus dive. Trying to get this kill onto Fly Fly. They might just take what they can get and go for, yeah, go for Ali. Why not? Yeah, I don't, I don't know what that AM blink was about. I mean, the only reason the Wyvern dies though is because the AM just blinked in, right? Mm -hmm. he, he just went all in for it. And he... Oof, if they had a stun there, he might have just been dead under the tower. Uh, it depends on the game. I mean, Venge is one of those heroes that can literally build anything, and it's always going to be okay. Bot lane, S-Triple-C though. Yeah, oh, he ends no. up getting traded. Kaka <laughs> didn't have CCC, but JT getting the trade. Radiance bottom tower. still looking. He's gonna though. go in here as well. And now he blinked XM's in. Coming. They'll go for Ollie instead. They'll get the kill into the Winter Wyvern. That's the second time they were just like, I guess we'll kill Winter Wyvern instead. But Dark Ascension, Fly Fly. Now with the Void, he just He's uh, gonna keep going on try XM, to blink though. away. SCC's dead, by the way, to JT. And one more right click from XM kills off the Anti Mage. Oh, he TP's mid lane instead of going back to base. So he still doesn't have any mana to work with. JT in return? Yeah, they're just going to run at the draw again. This is insane. Like, what does mm. SCCC do? Yeah. Oh, good cogs. I think yeah, that keeps SCCC alive. That's still worth it. Do they both die? Oy. I think JT goes for this. Yeah, you have to go for this. Slowed up TP? No, just a multi shot. He doesn't have a TP. It's on cooldown, so he's just dead again. Wow. Do you remember when I said I thought JT and Kaka were EKB not just really strong still? Like the normal? Ascension, uh, top. Ascension. Kill out on Ollie. They can find JT. Look shot. They got the hook shot in, and I mean, now they're trying to get this kill. Icarus dive over. James comes in, and JT, he'll end up dying. That's a kill for Xnova and a mass. Dream coil. And the silence with the waning rift. Anybody coming over to help him? Not at the moment. I'm not going to waste the supernova on that. And I actually like that. Sometimes you'll see, like, just go into the supernova, try and delay, but they can fight with this supernova soon. If the rest of his team is... Oh, Doom on Night Stalker. Yeah, he's on the run. I think Xnova is looking for the, <laughs> the oh, deny, but that's not going to come. Fly Fly gets the kill with the mana void. Two most expensive components. Yeah, but, you know, even so. Double Wraith Van Treads Perseverance. Just Butterfly Vect. He might be in trouble. Swap comes in, and he's got nowhere to go. They've got the silence on him. They'll get the kill. Ollie, Chalice though. as well. Chalice in pretty deep. Swaps taking. Look at where this supernova is. They get both Ali and Kaka. That's very well done by Ehom. James kills them on the same tick with the egg as well, so he gets the double we'll kill. They, they can't. They can't set up with a Venge done is the problem, right? Because of this counter spell. So. Oh, that's no Shot misses. Now the magic missile. Now the winter's curse. I'm gonna go for this, but Chalice and X Nova are okay while the other side of this fight, they've got the Dark Ascension as well as the Silence out onto the roof. He stole bank. it! They're chasing <laughs> Kaka, who with his own Dark Ascension was flying away on his broomstick, <laughs> but wasn't able to get too far out of the reach of XM, who now finds Ollie, and they've got themselves two on the side of Ehom. He's got the Dragon Lance in the Ashley, he's going into the Manta. Like, he's really recovered and done quite well for himself. Hook shot. Coming. Coming through on a butterfly effect. Gets Ooh. into the phase shift. They get the kill on Ollie. They've got the swap. Then the silence on Akaka. Steal swap, but he'll lose it as he loses his life soon after taking that. And the blink dagger for this Night Stalker. I think I that... get to see it, but it feels really strong sometimes. There's certain games where you just, just run at them nonstop and they can't really do anything. There was a time when Night Sucker just felt like it got picked all the time, too. Oh, yeah, boy, everybody here. Four. Chalice is in a very far out spot. They'll go right on top in three shots. Basically, 
Chalice still doesn't end up dead just yet. Finally falls to JT, and that is the first charge on that BKB used. And look at that, XM just runs at these heroes. Goes after Butterfly Effect, who would jaunt in the Illusory He's going to keep going. Forward, yeah. he goes in under a Tier 3 with a... Night Stalker, BKB. Oh, finds the Anti-Mage. They stop the TP. Counter spell, blink away, and now the hook shot from X Nova, the combination to catch Fly Fly out. They rush. He's a, a big Aegis timing for him. Is under attack. Dyer's top tower this should is under put attack. XM in front of the Doom, too. Roshan has fallen to the radiant. Never mind. Immortality. They're having a great time. I mean, IG kind of, they're going to make a smoke here. They're a little bit, they were a little bit stuck in their base there. They have the blink BKB on Doom though. Infernal Blade, Telekinesis, everything out on X Nova. So but they've got the though. swap, they have the Sunray. They'll get the save for X Nova. Butterfly Effect now on the run. Wyvern. But you look at XM just go to the back lines and kill the Winter Wyvern hook shot on a Satyr. So that's not exactly who you're looking for. But the BKB's been used. They've got the swap. And okay, GT back. blinks afterwards, so he was able to oh, I am. Some space. Oh, anti mage. They'll find him. So, if they don't get a good curse off in fights, I don't know how IG is supposed to win the fights. They didn't use Doom either. Like, blink waning rift, as well as the uh, infernal blade on the chalice, but they've got that sunray. They'll take the tier three. 16 seconds till the anti mage is up, but even then, I don't know if he's again ready to fight. Right click's coming through on Akaka. He's on the run by the multi shot. They'll get the kill. They will go over GT. It's so much damage. Cold Embrace, uh, Winter's Curse. Uh, that. Uh, okay. Uh, just. Sick yeah. Illusion Bait. Hook, Hook shot. shot hits the Anti Mage. And now, look at this. They've got the silence. They'll get the kill again on a Fly Fly Supernova. Hit the egg. In between the tier fours. <laughs> I mean, that is just. That's putting down the hammer on. You guys can't do anything to us. I'm going to put the supernova in between both your tier 4 towers. But it's like... Yeah. <laughs> it, it doesn't... Now they don't have curse or do. So, the homer going to run at them. Swap, stun, waning rift, but they still can't even kill Chalice. And they just destroy this Rubik. They're going to go for more, and they just call GG. Wow. Another sub 25 minute game. Dude, XM played so well on this Night Stalker. Look, yeah. that first rotation he made to top lane was crazy. Like, like really good, I mean. It, it was all... Back. Midas from XM worked into a BKB and a Blink Dagger. And he's... Okay, so that deals with the Egg as well. It deals damage into Chrono. Yeah. Lanes well yeah. against Ember if they put it mid. Lanes when it... Bottom end, we saw... This was... Was this the lane we saw with that Morphling game? Was it with a Witch Doctor? Mm. Uh, it was, I say it was AA, right? I think, right? Wasn't it? Was it? No, he had a tiny in his lane, and they were against um, Pangolin Darks here before. Avalanche toss up top. Ali in some He's trouble. In trouble and they'll get well. first blood. Bottom though, silence out on SCCC. They might be able to trade on Chalice. A kill here onto the Phoenix would be big, and they will. Yeah, that kill is massive for the Void. That, that, that's really worth it for him. Kakarot in bottom as well. Doesn't I was gonna say he doesn't have wind run yet. So. Stop you. What was it? Radiance we were seeing. Is under was it Aster who did it? X Nova bot lane. It's a level one first. Yeah. Power oh. shot. Nicely done by Kaka. Bottle coming out now. The four minute runes spawning. So you see the two radiant supports just sitting oh. mid. They might make yeah, the play. They want to go for this kill. They've got themselves Ooh. the cask as well as the avalanche Something toss. They get the kill on a butterfly effect. Four minute oh, rune. He's gonna. He's is, gonna get the rune uh, on the ember. Not picked up by Kaka and available for XM. Oh my god, this lane is really sad for the leader. No, like she was doing really well, but she's in top lane by the way. Uh, okay. Small fling. Gotta make sure you get a cast bouncing around. Kaka with the Maledict, but they've got themselves the Shackle Power Shot and the Blood Right trying to TP out, but the damage is there. They get the kill on X Nova. Chal's getting low. He Icarus dives away. 
Ollie though. But Ollie burns out to the fire spirits. Yeah, that's a really rough day. XM coming bottom, so JT might be in some trouble. He's got level six, uses that rupture, but here comes XM. They're gonna come over towards bottom, blood right down SCC here with the help of X Nova as well as this Ember. So JT trying to run, but they've got the Maledict, now the Searing Chains, they'll get the kill. XM will get credit on this Bloodseeker and back. because it's stopping him from just getting free farm, right? Yes, it was kind of like right next to the wave. Avoid? No! Oh, fly, fly. For the moment. That game was close too in the beginning. Well, yeah, but. I don't know. I feel like last game it was much easier for E Home to push the tempo. This one, it's kind of more like. Less of a draft win and more of like a, a just it's gonna be like more of an outplay kind of thing, right? Over mid lane Ollie. James, Supernova down, and now they get the kill on Ollie, they end up losing James, they'll go for the egg. Can they get it? Oh. Oh. <laughs> just on the edge, but this is requiring everybody to be here, man. Dyer's bottom tower is under attack. Radiant structures are requiring them all to be over here. Oh they have You're gonna be fine. And that's the thing, like, that egg goes off, and I think that's Chuckle. the difference between one kill and four. It looks oh. to get this kill on SCCC, and Bloodright goes down, and... Radiant's bottom. Dyer's middle tower is under attack. How's XM doing? Radiant's bottom tower is under All attack. three Dyer heroes sitting one, two, three at the moment. Uh, they have spirit. Uh, oh, they have shot. spirit vessel in a hundred gold on the Phoenix, but... And the LSA yeah. with the Laguna Blade, XM, sleight of fist! And they'll use the rupture to get the kill on XM. All gets credit for that one. Now they'll look over at X Nova. He's on the run, avoids the blood right. Yeah, yeah, avoids in chase. trouble though. Yeah, up towards top, fly fly, he ends up dead. They'll use the supernova this time, it goes off. So yes, you lose XM mid, now, mid but getting the kill on a fly fly. Back over towards mid, they're looking like they want to go in. Oh, two man stun with the blood right down and the cogs. It really looks like they wanted to use that Death War to get something here, but they're not going to find it. And now Witch Doctor's dead for 22 seconds. They might even lose the tier one. Here comes like XM TPing back in, though. I mean, James is 200 gold off Blink on Tiny. But he is just 50 gold away. I think if this would have waited till the Blink, it would have been a little bit better. But they'll go Avalanche, Toss, Spirit Vessel, JT dead regardless. <laughs> that was a brave so TP. <laughs> Whenever they do this hunting party together. Shot Chrono. Uh, the hookshot doesn't actually get all the way through. They'll try to get we'll this kill on XM, but the avalanche toss on a so many. And they get the kill on a butterfly effect. He's gonna turn out really yeah. poor the side of IG. The remnant all the way to the back line looking for fly fly. A rupture used on XM. They get the kill on Ollie. Now they've got the blood right down. Let's see if IG can uh, secure anything, but not looking likely. Chalice. Does have Supernova, they'll find Kaka. Avalanche is there. Cast to follow it up. Now the Death War, Blood right down, but it doesn't hit on anybody. They lose three in this exchange. And this is exactly my problem. As soon as Tiny gets blink, the game just gets thrown wide open. Because they have so many squishies on Dyer's side. Void's dead as well to the Spirit Vessel. Wow, under the tier two. Like how they might just lose control of this game. All right now. Side of fist searing chains, Again. avalanche toss, JT just dead. He buys back. Yeah, he knows that they have to make something happen now, otherwise the game's gonna get really hard. But like, they really quick. Though. They get Chalice though. They on get the Phoenix. Chalice. And I mean, is that enough? Avalanche oh, toss, you was fly fly here, and this might just be awful. Oh, yeah, XM gets the kill. Yeah, they killed James, but oi. <laughs> okay, X over as well. Okay, so they're getting a few. Chalice. Gonna smoke up on Radiant, I think. Going They're Heaven's Halberd. Sight Searing Chains, that hits onto the Void. Fly Fly goes in with the Avalanche. LSA looking for the Meteor Hammer, and XM's dead. Chrono onto the Tiny, but they've got the Spirit Vessel on a Fly uh, Fly. Uh, Supernova? Okay, James. Uh, Chalice. Here comes Morph, though. I mean, the only reason that fight goes badly is because so. 
God King. God King, yeah, that's it. We saw this from God King yesterday and we talked about it a little bit then, but uh, Tiny. Bloodseeker 2. Nice had the cast them. bounce around. Now they've got the blood right down. Rupture out on the chalice. Doesn't have the supernova, but they're gonna look over the clockwork. They end up losing James. I think you go Roche. They're still. You get popped in top lane. Got popped in top lane by the yours. So. Uh oh, hook shot. Real big whiff. And now Ollie, he's just dead of the Maledict, so. Really, X Nova can walk away. He's in the cogs, but nobody's gonna kill him afterwards. Oh yeah, this is a top tier too. It was the last game I saw. It. We'll get this. Like Firefly's not really getting anything, right but he's gonna look for the Chrono. Now you've got Butterfly Pack coming in with a Laguna Blade LSA. They get the kill on an XM. So he waited a long flame. time to go for that Chrono. Yeah, they, they need to get out here on uh, Hook shot on X Nova head. Shackle though onto the clockwork and are they gonna go for the supernova? I don't think so. Oh, they got they, the move. Whoa! SCCC just getting blown up. Sunray on a fly fly, but butterfly effect all of a sudden Where? just gets a triple kill. That's a where's the tiny fight for Eho. Top farming. Right. It's been all IG since. Top lane, Butterfly Effect, he's spotted by James. Fail, Avalanche toss with the E-Blade, dead before he even hits the ground. Five times spree going the way of James, that's a lot of gold for him. Oh. And they want to make sure they play under their own vision here on the high ground. JT walking over, spots X Nova. And Cask Maledict bounces and hits a bunch of these heroes. Now the rupture is used. Remnant all the way to the back lines, looking over for Flyfly. Remnant once again, they get the kill on a JT. X Nova loses his life. Seconds. ends up being in a one for one, but yeah, 80 seconds. Nobody. Void's getting can... really farmed. Yeah, a... Morph has BKB as well, which is a big deal. So now they can, they can only really deal with him with Chrono. They're gonna smoke again, so we'll see if he, he home can do anything near the pit. Look for a fight and then back up into the Roche pit. I think they were a little bit worried that IG were gonna go for Roche as well, but oh, the change. And that's gonna hit on two. Chrono just on the edge! Oh my! Hits on a you James got morph as off, well though. as SCCC. They got the BKB off. Now they've got the Supernova. Flyfly, his BKB is about to run out. Needs to be careful, remnant away, and they only get the Windrunner for the Tiny. Both of those heroes buy back. Rupture, blood right on the ground, but Windrunner just bought back, ends up dead. They get the kill on a Chalice, they take out X Nova. They look for James as well as a CCC. They've got the Spirit Vessel onto the Morphling. They die hit back the on James. onto James. So it's a dieback on the Windrunner as well as the Tiny. They bought back on Chalice. So the game has gone over 30. First of the day. And it's up. In a rush. This is going to be close. Chrono down for another 10 seconds. They, they know they're in there though. The smoke broke. Slight avalanche toss. Hook shot. Now fly fly. Aegis down. Picked up by the void. They get the kill on Ollie. He's dead for 74 seconds. He did just use buyback. Chrono's Chrono comes out. Shackle. But now Ember trying to survive this Chrono. Supernova will go off. They've got the Avalanche as well as the Toss out on a JT, but it's not going to be enough damage just yet. The LSA comes through as well as the BKB popped by the Selena. Avalanche out. James gets the kill on a JT. They've lost XM. He buys back. He comes back into the fight. They get the kill on a Butterfly Effect. They've taken him to the Lena. He's dead for 84 seconds. Oh, TP. Oh, the slide just on the edge of the TP. So they stop the TP. They've it's got changed. the Aegis. Well. They're for the kill. They've got the Searing Jades. And there it is. A kill on a Fly Fly for a second time. Oh, my goodness. I mean, has, they may have got... massive for you home. Oh, no. Oh, hook shot avoided. X Nova. Four staff coming in clutch. Yeah. Avalanche toss E blade. Butterfly effect survives. And now they get the kill on a butterfly effect. He's gonna be dead, but has the buyback. They'll use the chrono that hits on the morphing as well as the tiny. They'll turn their attention towards James. They'll get the kill of the BKB from Flyfly is about to run out. So he needs to back off from this fight, I I'd say. They've gotten themselves the ensnare on a fly fly with the clumsy net. Thanks, Nova. They need to get Continuing out. Continuing to heal. Silence is there. Sight of fist, Searing Chains comes through in a JT. 
Shackle. Oh, the shackle. <laughs> but Lotus all the way back to Kaka. I was really hoping that was going to be some like clutch Lotus. <laughs> he gets ruptured and he's like, hell yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I, I, I don't know. I, I thought the standard, at least right now, is just Sunray with the uh, Supernova. Oh, what lane? Killing Axe Nova. Now they will go over. James, who just got back alive, he ends up surviving for a split second, but Butterfly Effect gets the finishing blow. They get the kill to Kaka now with the BKB Popeye Flyfly, who try to TP out. SCC commits to it, but oh, Kaka on the high ground with this ward, I believe, saw that smoke. Hook shot splits the seams. Ooh, unlucky there for Ollie. Radiant's bottom tower is under attack. Very unlucky Bracken. for Ollie. Like how you think about it positively. He misses the hook shot and we're like, oh, yeah. Chrono on the, the back, back lines. Line. They're going to go right for Chalice. He didn't beat from James. And now they've got the Supernova off. Ollie ends up going down. They're going to go after Butterfly Effect. They still get the egg. But Butterfly Effect is in so much trouble. They've got the Death Ward down. They get the kill out of the Lena. Butterfly Effect gone. Chalice ended up dead. They've got the Rupture out onto the Ember. But look at this. Fly Fly now needs to run. Blood right down onto the ground. Silence is up. All three of these heroes who are still in it. Rupture again used on the Ember. Otis Orb on the Ember of XM. He's running around. He's sitting low. But they've got the Toss. They get the kill out of Fly Fly. Triple kill for SCCC. Oh, the Void didn't want to be Kibbe at all, right, from the yeah, high ground see, as well. he pulled her over, and that's what ends yeah. up getting her kill. Exactly. Yeah, and now they have no Chrono either, and the Morphing's still alive. Yeah, uh, but bye-bye. Like, yeah, it, almost inevitably going to get forced, right? But he doesn't have Chrono, so you just concede as much as, he, as what if, you're willing. I think he, he's going to have to, well, Tier 2's still up bot lane, but yeah, he's going to have to buy back. But one, he doesn't have Chrono. Two, his Lena's still dead. So, you know, how useful is it? Rupture on XM again. But this, you can see the power of the axe here, though, right? James, toss. I, I was about to say, is he level 25 and just going to toss the entire team over to the Radiant side? But Kaka, ring. Kaka ends up dead. SCC. Oh, hook shot goes to the back. It's uh, XM. That's not where he was intending that to go, but it ends up hitting it here on the side of the Radiant. Waveform back looking over at Ollie. They've got the rupture used once again. That's out on to James, who tosses JT in the air. Blood <gasps> right down. He's running at a decent speed, but the waveform no. forward as well as the E Blade and SCC tries to get this kill with the adapter strike. Gets it. Did you see James TP away there? He just popped Ghost Scepter and TP. He was like, see you later, Phil. Fools. I was going to say nerds, but you know, don't want to steal the voice line. KB popped by Fly Fly trying to man fight this, but SCCC forces back Fly Fly, who's now without the BKB for 65 seconds, and it's down to five. No waveform out of time lock that off, but they've lost well, they a smoked. set of racks over Dallas top. They top do top smoke, top. but the racks are gone. I was thinking about this talent on the Phoenix as well, that he's the one that needs to die first, right? If you're the dire side, the Phoenix has to die. Because the egg is too annoying, the supernova is too annoying. Sorry, the the sun ray is too annoying. So maybe the dive range is to help. Oh, hang Whoa. on, fight. That is so ballsy by SCCC, but he doesn't even care. He'll go right in. They'll get the kill into Kaka now. Fly, fly, dusted. <gasps> Ooh, needs to be very careful. Clumsy net. They've got the wave form. BKB gets popped, but the avalanche comes in. It's not going to matter. Fly, fly, now trying to run with the time walk away, but the Corona Spear is used uh -huh. on an XM. He doesn't quite have the damage. Uh, He's been halberded. <laughs> and, well, Chalice will lose his life. He keeps XM alive. He does have the buyback. He can't bounce his back to the clock. They get the kill on Ali. They look over Butterfly Factor with the adaptive strike hitting. They get the kill. They'll take out the Lena. They look over at this Blood Seeker as well as Void. They've called GG, and it's a 2 0 for E Home. Really well played by him in the. I think that game was so much better to watch than the others we think today. Normally, normally.